Good morning. I'm sitting on the swing in the backyard. It's the very beginning of June. And I thought we go check out the new bullfrog pool and our turtle pond. And we'll see what's going on. So come with me. Well, we can see Zuzu right away. He's close up on her. There's Zuzu in her new favorite place right behind the ceramic bullfrog. So yes, that's a very real live frog right there. She's a big old bullfrog. Hey Zuzu. Chris got a frog spitter for the pond as well. You can see some of the goldfish. I try to call this a pool instead of a pond most of the time so that you can English easily distinguish between the two areas. Looks like Frankie's coming out of the turtle tunnel. Let's go see Frankie, though he may run off. See you later, Zuzu. There's Frankie. He used to be a baby. He's not mature yet, but he's growing. And he's still small enough to go through the turtle tunnel to be over here in the very shady bullfrog pool. And it's a place where the younger turtles can go without being followed and harassed by adults because the adults are too big. We made sure we blocked the entrance on the other side so the bigger turtles can't get through. All right, so let's back out here and go check out the turtle pen. Now I still have electrical cords over here in the bullfrog pool area. That's because we're gonna change the layout for the pump. And we're gonna run an offshoot of our electrical back here for the pump, but right now we've got it all hooked up by extension cords, electrical extension cords. Okay. Let's see what's going on over here. Looks pretty quiet. All the turtles were out earlier. And I took pictures of all of them but Morgan. I missed my opportunity to get Morgan. And there's the entrance to the turtle tunnel. You can see we've got a piece of wood blocking half of it so that only the smaller turtles can get through. And James Bond's down there at the base of the water iris. Hey, James. James Bond is a girl. She's our only red-eared slider turtle. The rest are box turtles. Western box turtles, to be specific. Some are ornate western box turtles, and some are desert western box, box turtles. Now, let's see. Let's go into the turtle pen. See if we see anybody on the other side. All right now we've rehomed the last of our babies, so I'm not so worried about every little step I take. We don't have any tiny babies right now. Well, you can see that's where a turtle had been right there.
see a lot of mealworms and stuff. For the turtles. Looks oh. so like Francis is hiding in the back there under the corner. She usually goes back there when Chuck is chasing her, trying to breed. Hey, Francis. But I don't know where he's at right now. At any rate, it's a great day. My catalpa's in bloom. Got overcast clouds on about a quarter of the sky. Makes it cooler for me. Over here on the other side of the fence from the turtle pin, I got some green paint for Memorial Day weekend and started painting the background behind the trees of the mural. Chris, with the help of our friend Bruce, put in the cement pad for the future dwarf goat feed shed. You can see it's kind of a construction over here, right? A construction area right now. There's Brutus. Hey, Brutus. Digging in the sand to make a cool place to lay down. He is a silly boy. Anyway, this is my home. There's the swing where I was sitting. I uh, hope you all have a great day. Pretty soon the sunflowers will have to be thinned out better. And then they will grow a lot taller and we'll have blossoms and we'll have lots of pollinator bees back here. And I'll come take some pictures of that for you. Have a fabulous day. Come visit us again. And make sure you're obedient to the Lord while you're at it. That's the most important thing.